guys, this is Pixel Dan coming to you from the 2019 New York Toy Fair, and I'm here at the Playmates Toys booth with John to talk about Ben 10. How's it going? It's going great, going great. Ben's uh, Ben's doing fantastic still. Um, we continue on with uh, actually Cartoon Network is starting season three uh, this week, uh, which is great. They've greenlit the season four, and as you'll see, we have some uh, figures to show you that cover some of the new characters in season three and season four. Oh, excellent! I can't wait to see them. So, what do we got here? So basically this first uh, table here just kind of shows where we're at with our current basic figures. Uh, there's 22 figures so far on this table. Uh, but then introducing uh, new figures for spring, I'll show you some of these new items over here. Okay, let's do it. Okay. So uh, these are our new items for spring. Uh, ben actually has three new aliens that he can turn into. Uh, he has Slapback, Humongousaur, and Wrath. So Ben can now turn into those characters. And now he's facing in season three his nemesis, Kevin Eleven. It's an old time nemesis yeah. who they're bringing back in season three. Kevin 11. So you can see Kevin 11 here and one of Kevin's aliens, Hotshot, uh, which is the uh, heat blast, the bad heat blast uh, guy. Got it. Um, and then Ben has a new look as well. This is his rust buggy outfit. So you see him kind of outfitted in his, in his typical Omnitrix green. Love it. Yeah. I love it. The new aliens are really exciting stuff. Yeah. Kevin 11, that's awesome. That's right. And then uh, for fall, uh, we have our new. Uh, Omni Glitch Heroes. So this is kind of a mix and match system. Cool. We're introducing two to start different parts. Kids can sort of move the parts around uh, to create their own aliens. Um, and then they'll, you can interact with the other figure as well. So you can pull figures off of one, uh, parts off one figure and put them on the other figure to mix and match. And then, as promised, this is the new characters for season four. Um, and uh, so we're introducing um, three armored aliens. And these aliens are taking on a more powerful form for Ben in season four. And so you'll see uh, some of their versions here. There's Armored Heat Blast, Humongousaur, and Diamond Head. Wow, that yeah. is awesome. Yeah. So there's a lot of really great looking stuff coming out with the basic line, and I love the mix and match parts too. That is always a fun play right. feature. Right, exactly. So yeah, we're just gonna continue on with that as uh, we go on with the different seasons. So, um, and I don't remember if uh, you've seen this before, uh, Dan, but- I've actually seen these in stores. They just okay. started hitting, yep. they I just think. just started hitting the stores. So this is our transforming deluxe figures. And basically the idea, it's the whole idea of Ben changing from Ben to alien and back again. So with a, a simple uh, mechanism, you can switch from Ben to alien and back and, and back and forth again. So yeah, these just hit now uh, on shelves and we're actually gonna be TV promoting these in March as well. Excellent, yeah. all right. So then we'll move down to our Omnitrix. Uh, so again, for Ben, it's all about the Omnitrix. We're expanding that line quite a bit. So now in addition to just the basic lights and sounds Omnitrix, we're actually updating that with the new season three look for the Omnitrix, which is right here. Um, and uh, it'll have the new aliens on board as well. So all new phrases from the new, for the new aliens as well as the old aliens. And as part of that same assortment, the alien projection Omnitrix. So when you put a little uh, disc film inside, you can select the aliens that you want to project on the wall or the ceiling and uh, very simply become that alien by pressing it in your Omnitrix. Right. Awesome. Yes. Great. So that's our basic Omnitrix. And then in our deluxe Omnitrix assortment, we have our current deluxe Omnitrix, which is very much a replica from the show. It works very much the same way as the show in terms of the mechanics, has over 100 phrases and sound effects has different motion activations as well, so you can really battle as the aliens. And then introducing in fall, we're gonna have our alien game Omnitrix. So this has an LCD screen on board. There's four different game modes and kids can actually play games right on that LCD screen. Awesome, yeah. wow, that is really cool. I love that, seeing just all the different ways that you offer the Omnitrix right. out there. That's exactly. so great. And there's even one more. We have our walkie-talkie Omnitrix as well, that's right. <laughs> So two, uh, you get two uh, walkie-talkie Omnitrix. They actually are wearable. You can actually, there's straps on them so you can wear them as an Omnitrix. Give one to your friend and then you can communicate up to 50 feet with that. Oh, that is so good. So we'll move yeah. down to our uh, Ben 10 play sets. So last fall we introduced the Alien Creation Chamber. This is a way for kids to really mix and match parts and create their own aliens. And then they have their little three inch figure that they can play with. When they're all done, they just pull the parts off, reload the chamber and create a new alien as well. Right. So we are doing very well with this uh, um, out of the gate. Uh, we're introducing the two packs so you can extend into new aliens as well. Oh yeah, so I see some of our new aliens are included in there now. Exactly, right. So we'll be extending those uh, with the two packs. Uh, and so very excited about this item. Another new play set uh, for fall is our micro play sets. Oh, wow. So these micro play sets fold up so that they look like the Omnitrix. And of course, yes, you can still wear them as an Omnitrix. <laughs> 
But then when you open it up, you'll see that you, they open up into these play environments. We're doing Heat Blast World and we're doing Inside the Omnitrix. A lot of great little fidget pl play features in there as well. They'll each come with a couple different micro figures and some uh, accessories as well. That is so cool. Yep. Wow, I love that. I love. I always love the classic micro figure right. play sets that right. open up. That is so neat. Right. So yeah, and the combination of it being an Omnitrix as yeah. well, we think it's a winner. So. Yeah, that's fantastic. Yeah. Uh, and then for vehicles, we have our um, Alien with Vehicle. That's uh, an existing item that's out there and our existing Rust Bucket. So that's continuing to sell well. It's the great big vehicle and playset combination that works with all your basic figures. So, awesome. Yeah. Now, in the last couple of years, you showed us like a larger playset for Ben 10. Is that something that might still so, be in the works? No. So that's something, unfortunately, that's uh, oh, no. going, going away. But because we're doing enough uh, with our base, our, with our Rust Bucket vehicle, okay. Um, we really feel that this is the appropriate play set for, for Ben 10. Gotcha. Yeah. All right. Well, hey, there's still a lot of really exciting things happening for Ben 10. The micro play sets, new basic figures, right. new Omnitrixes. Omnitrixes yep. So much is happening, and I love to see the Ben 10 line still just growing and getting bigger. Absolutely. Yeah, we're, we're, we're very excited again. This is our third year. We're very excited. Yeah, excellent. Yeah. Well, thank you, John, so much for taking sure. the time to walk us through all thank this. Thank you very much, Dan. Awesome. Well, there you guys go. A look at Ben 10 on display at the 2019 New York Toy Fair. Stay up to date with Pixel Dan at Toy Fair 2019. Follow at Pixel Dan on Twitter or forward slash Pixel Dan on YouTube.com. Thanks for tuning in to your premier source for all things toys, Pixel Dan. See you again.